All right, the last thing, the last skill in this uh, basic clinch fighting uh, stuff is going to be hand fighting. All right, now uh, all this is is getting two on one control on my partner's uh, hand, arm, elbow, limb. All right, two on one control, and she's trying to do the same to me. So it's going to be competitive, but what you don't want to do is try to not get caught because we're going to artificially uh, put ourselves in a position where there's no space um, between our heads and then we're just going to go. So the idea here is that both of, we're both trying to get two on one at the same time. She's going to get two on one a bunch. I'm going to get two on one a bunch. It's more a matter of practicing releasing grips, regripping, releasing grips, regripping. It's really important, especially if, when, uh, when weapons are involved, right? She draws a, a, something out of her waistband and getting very comfortable with immediately clamping onto that, that limb and getting two on one in that limb is a very, very important and useful skill. The way you're gonna do this, you're gonna go forehead to forehead and both of our hands and my elbows are gonna remain in front of our torso. So never back here, right in front of the torso. And then when we say go, Make sure you're not like headbutting each other. So keep your heads in contact. When we say go, we're just gonna go two on one. Just go two on one on me. Yeah, there you go, good. And we're just gonna keep going back and forth, breaking grips, a little bit of head pressure. I, well, as soon as I have two on one, I let it go and I try to go to a different two on one. You can use your uh, Self-defense wrist breaks that you learned in your self-defense classes. Those all work just fine. But the idea here is to get two on one. And don't do this. Ready? Go ahead. Because it defeats the purpose. All right? You're going to go head to head. If your heads break contact, so go. Ready? If your heads break contact, just stop, reset, touch heads, and go. So I'm peeling her hands off, I'm breaking grips, and at the same time, trying to get two on one on her. Okay, now you're gonna put it all together. So start with the pummel, and then try to get outside of the elbows, try to get double underhooks, try to get to your partner's back, using all of those skills at the same time. Ready, go. <laughs> 